I have to say that this was by far one of the coolest projects we have ever worked on. Dr. Igor Staglar, a molecular biologist at the University of Toronto, and his team started working on a unique way to measure immunity to COVID-19. Staglar said it started last year after his colleague came back from Wuhan, China, and spoke about the virus. Why this test is interesting is because they are using enzymes that help fireflies glow. Uh, this test is special since it is the first COVID-19 serology test that uses this highly sensitive uh, complementation chemistry, uh, which takes advantage of uh, a modified form of luciferase, which is a very interesting enzyme that gives fireflies their light emitting power through a biochemical reaction. The blood test will measure the amount of antibodies that are present and fighting the coronavirus. The team is excited as this may also be able to assess antibody levels and this could be integral in finding out over time if someone after being vaccinated is still being protected against COVID-19. So for example, someone gets vaccinated with uh, let's say Pfizer vaccine, we can then uh, draw blood, we can just take a, a pinprick uh, of, of a blood from these people. We can mix it with these three reagents. Uh, we uh, incubate this for one hour, and uh, one hour later, we know exactly how many antibody molecules uh, a person has uh, after the vaccination. So this is very important because we will be able to control the immunity in people uh, after vaccinations because we don't know how long this pandemic will end, uh, will last. Dr. Stegler says their test is a lot cheaper at $2 compared to the ones being used now in hospitals. You can also find a detailed video about the test on our website, citynews.ca slash extras. In Toronto, I'm Brandon Rowe for City News.